bring having my meals brought up. Lillian Horowitz is self-isolating after a fellow resident at this assisted living centre tested positive for COVID-19. I'm not to answer the door to anybody and uh, what can I do? The mayor of Cote St. Luke, a city on the island of Montreal, says there are at least four cases there and he's worried. The virus can spread very quickly. And because we have all these religious institutions where gatherings were going on uh, until uh, a few days ago, uh, and we have um, so many snowbirds returning to our community, we know there's potential for Cote St. Luke to be an epicenter for the virus. The mayor is urging the province to close all non-essential businesses and to consider a quarantine in his city if cases go up. Cote St. Luke is densely populated with a large Jewish community and a high concentration of seniors. One of the people infected attended a wedding with 400 guests held last week at this synagogue. All guests now instructed to self-isolate for 14 days. The world has changed so drastically in the eight days since, since that wedding took place. And at the time uh, of the wedding, even until the next day, none of the synagogues in Montreal had, had yet closed. And the following morning, we made the decision to, to close. This synagogue wrote to members to warn there are cases here, too, and told people who recently attended to stay home. The general message went out to all because everybody is connected to somebody that is a senior or is compromised, whether they know it or not, they have a connection. Montreal Public Health says all religious groups should stop all gatherings. Religious groups are vectors of transmission, are important vectors of transmission. Please follow the order. The mayor of Cote St. Luke says synagogues there have now done that, but says it's a shame it didn't happen sooner. Alison Northcott, CBC News, Montreal.